What's going on, you guys? Bad Ammo Freak here. By myself. By me, myself, and I. And today we're going to be playing Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. And today, I'm thinking what we're going to do is we're going to go over there and kill that. That son of a bitch over there. Say, so what do I got on my quick bar? I need divine confetti on my quick bar. Yeah, I can take away pellets and give myself the pacifying agent because he is there and he is square. I fucking hate the dogs. Fucking dumbass. Alright. So there's more dogs over here as well. There we go. Two more dogs down. And over here, of course, is that son of a bitch. He fucking sucks. Oh my god. He's... He's kind of hard to kill. Uh, but so what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and sneak around him. Get us a little death blow on this fag. Okay, so he sees me. Get up, please. I'm begging you. There we go. There's a dog around here. I, I just fucking saw him. I'm gonna kill this dog so I can get this shit down here. Okay, so that was fairly lucky. Uh, I need to drink up because he, he can still see me and he can shoot me through walls and that is no bueno. Possession balloon, that's nice. Possession balloon, that's nice. So I don't, there's probably no items down there. I think I already got them all. Okay, cool. Cool. So, uh, we're going to try and get a sneak attack on him. Because I don't think he, he definitely doesn't see us. So I'm pretty sure a sneak attack, somewhere I read, it requires divine confetti. So we need a drop down. Well, that didn't work how I wanted it to. I got terror? How did I even get terror? See what I mean when I say these guys fucking are annoying? I... Oh, he's over there. Dodge. Dodge. Okay, he's gonna disappear now. I'm guessing he's gonna turn around be over here. So run over here. Run back over here. Oh my god, I barely made it. Alright, alright. We got this, dude. We got him. I'm gonna go put on my... Aw, oh, shit. I need divine confetti. Okay. Um, pacifying agent. Where's he at? Okay. I need to drink up. Oh, uh, see, that's why I was getting uh, cursed. Okay. I'm dead. Okay. Okay, dude. 
You're, you're pissing me off. So, I gotta get him. Dude! I can get him. I can get him. There we go. That's one down. He's gonna disappear. Uh, this is a perfect time to use Divine Confetti. This dude is honestly the worst. See, he hits that every time, though. Drink up. There we go, there we go. Okay, cool. Run. Um, I need pacifying agent. Just in case. And divine confetti. Alright, I got your ass. Ah, oh, I got that ass, dude. I got that ass. He's half dead. I also have a resurrection. Oh, you're fucked, dude. You're fucked. There we go, there we go. He has two hits left and he's fucked. Two hits and he's dead. So he's gonna be over here for sure. Yeah, nice whiff, dude. Y'all, you're, you're fucked! That was definitely a roller coaster. I got some lapis. Hell fucking yeah. That was a roller coaster of an event. We were almost straight fuckered on that one. That one was a that one was a pretty scary sight. Let's see, where's the? Uh, there we go, homeward bone. <laughs> and then we got uh, well we can always put on Aqua Spirit Fall. I feel like that one's the best one in my opinion for sure. Uh, granted, I am no expert at the game, at all. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and teleport. Back to the last communed idol so we can rest. Let's go, boys. So it took us seven minutes to beat this fucking clown. Which is, uh, that's not too bad, I guess. He was the only thing holding me back from, uh, from greatness. So, in the previous part, which was like <laughs> clearly over a week ago, I went and swam in the water and I got everything that could possibly be gotten. Except I did not go to the next section. That was something I did not do. So, down here there is a cave that you go into. Oh, there's also two headless in the water. You know what, I'm fighting them. I don't care. I'm fighting the headless. This is a fighting episode. So the key to this is just to swim around in a circle. No, get away. Swim. Swim around. Swim around. Okay, he hit me still. Ain't that just swell. Uh, I need to drink up. Okay, whatever, dude. Oh my fuck. See, this is why there's two headless in the goddamn water. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna swim up. And I'm gonna fucking deal with these guys off camera. They're the fucking worst. I just don't, I just honestly don't feel like dealing with their fucking ass today. So I'm gonna go ahead and teleport back. To last commune to idle, and we're gonna go to the next part, which is like getting around this. Cause fighting the headless on camera is honestly infuriating. I just want to break everything in sight. Uh, cause I feel like it's not good content either. Because I'm just sitting here dying over and over and over and over. It's truly not even a th those the headless are not even a test of skill. It's a test on whether you can like get ganked and be okay with it. 
Because that's big facts how they gank the shit out of you. Like, you have no chance. Okay, so there's an underwater cave somewhere around here in this area, I believe. Probably more down would be my guess. But I don't want to go too far down because then them fucking gay ass headless will see me. Um. There's one of the headless. What a fucking punk bitch, dude. Where's that cave at? Cave. So, here's the headless. There's a second headless. The cool thing is once you get one of the headless down, they're fairly easy to, to get killed. Where is the cave at? Where's the cave entrance? I don't see it. I mean, I know it's somewhere around this area. There's a cave that takes you to the big fucking fish. Oh, you lucky bitch. It's back here, isn't it? Oh, I haven't got these? Word? Okay, that's cool. Oh, here's the cave. Here's the cave right here. Ceramic shards. Always pretty useful because you can always sell them. Oh, shit. There's the carp. I think the key to this is... You gotta go in here. Pretty much just make sure you're not seen by him. Because then you travel over there to that one. Which he can destroy because he's big as shit. So he sees me. So I'm going to automatically just sprint to the next one. Let's just go, just go, just go, just go. Yeah, he's, and he kills you instantly. He's, he's kind of a bitch. Swim up, dude. Swim up. You need to go in here? Oh, you're safe. You're safe. You're finally safe. Oh, shit. Oh, man. That dude's pretty... He's pretty shitty. Because you can't really, like... You can't attack him. You can't kill him. Unless you do the quest. Which I'm going to. But we'll save that for another day. So, there we go. I went under... Now I'm at a new location. Hell fucking yeah. So I need to get up there somehow. Which is through over here. Maybe. There we go. Up. Here we go. Up. So I don't remember. I straight up don't remember all the enemies that are over here. I know there's geckos somewhere. That's about it. I don't remember how to get up. I mean, it has been a while since I played this game. Maybe I just gotta use my super gecko muscles. Oh, there it is. Alright, sweet. New bonfire. There's a bunch of mist nobles in there. They're pretty, they're pretty awful. Let's go. Get 
Kill him, kill him. There we go. There's another one right here. Alright, there we go. There's all the Miss Nobles, I believe. I, I'm, there, I think there might be one more. Somewhere. He's, he's like hidden behind a wall. Uh, let's open this up. And there we go. We've made it full circle. Because down here was the son of a bitch. Sweet. So in here, there's a Miss Noble to the side. I'm, I'm positive about that. Alright, that's where I would have put it. I would have put it right here. Right here and it's hidden. Cause so when you go for the chest you just fucking die in hell. That'd have been that'd have been pretty pretty shit though. Gourd seed, don't mind if I do. That's pretty great. Alright, let's see what's over here. What's over here? Oh, this is the way to the motherfucking The uh, serpent, the great serpent, or whatever his name is. So what we need to do is we need to go over here. I believe there's, yeah. Yeah. Where's that jump point? There we go. There we go, yes. Secret area over here. Gecko! Gecko! So over here is where we start the great Khalid Cop series. Over here is pretty much an optional area. Got another divine confetti, that's nice. Yeah, 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 like I hear you. So got those. I don't remember exactly how many items are over here. Doesn't look like too many. I don't know, because when I'm over there, I usually see more items. It is what it is. Shut up, nigga. Maybe it's uh, on top of here. No, it's not on this. It is what it is. If I miss items, I miss items. Let's go ahead and sculpture's idol right here. So that we can return here into the future. Yeah, thank you. Um, what do I need? Straight up, need the mass fragment. I think that's the... This is the last piece I need. And then, of course, get some lapis in here. Hell yeah. So now I can upgrade one thing, I believe. Oh, well, please bring... Yeah, see, I got the dancing dragon's mats. Uh, this is the mask I was talking about where I didn't remember what it did. I looked it up. So it turns out that whenever you... Um, I'm at the Fountainhead Palace. Yeah, I'm over here. Turns out, whenever you get, um, what's it called? What? Why am I? What am I trying to say? What am I trying to say? Turns out, when you get five levels, pretty much, you can use those five levels to upgrade yourself. Oh, what's up, dude? That's very deep. Sorry. Sorry to hear that. Anyways, let's go. 
Oh, there's crystal lizards. Let's just get some kills real quick. Why not? Yeah, there we go. That was a level up right there. Somehow these fucking lizards give me 183 fucking experience. Like they're hard or something. They just fall off the walls. See, look, he's gonna fall off. That's a free kill. So I don't think we're gonna go up and fight the Divine Dragon just yet. Hear me out. Because, hear me out, I don't want to currently. Because that progresses the next piece of the puzzle to the next storyline. And I don't know if I want to do that yet. Mainly because, uh, uh, I still got shit to do in other places. I also got friends in low places. Where the whiskey drowns and the beer chases my blues away. So I'm not going to do it just yet. And there's stuff I still need to do in between the parts. Where the whiskey drowns and the beer chases my blues. I need to kill one of them. So I'm going to go ahead and hop down here, take a quick sippy poo. Oh, he's almost dead. Come on. So he killed me. I'm not too cheesed about it. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to resurrect. There we go. Get my resurrection back. Lock on. You're trapped in a corner, dude. I'm going to take a little double sipped up on a Tuesday. Why don't you fucking quit, dude? Yeah, I got him. There we go. Where, where is he at? Where did he go? I think he fell off the edge. Is that what happened? Yeah, I think that's what happened. I think dumbass fell off. Turns out he did not fall off. Well, behind every great story, there's an even better one. It's that he didn't get the jump off, and I'm about to cut him up to smithereens. Dude, how are you surviving so much? My attack damage is ridiculous. He survived like 15 hits. I don't know what this does. Is there like a secret area down there? I don't remember. Whatever. So up here is the way to the divine dragon. I believe. You know why? Well, I, I mean, I don't believe. I know it's up here. But, uh. I don't remember if this is the last checkpoint or not. So I'm gonna go ahead and rest. Get out of here. Let's go. There's items to get. Items to get, items to sell. Yeah, it's right here through there is where you fight the divine dragon, which I'm not ready to fight him yet. I want to kill them headless. I still have a gourd seed. You know how it e he he is. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over here. Where do we want to go? I want to start the great Khaled cop quest. So I got to figure out how to get over there. Huh. 
Let's try up the tree, maybe? On top of the tree? Where's it on top of the tree? Right here. Pretty pretty much nearing the end on this uh on this game. We're uh medium close I'd say. We're at the end, but like just right there. Like not super close, just close enough, you know. So the question is, how do I get over here? I think I remember. So this is not where I wanted to go. God damn. What I want to do is go over to the Miss Noble area, I believe, because there's a door opening over there, and I want to go through there. So I want to go to travel. I want to go to Fountainhead Palace, but I want to go to the palace grounds. Because right here, there, yeah, as I said previously, there's a door that opens up, and you want to go through that door. And I'm pretty sure you gotta get to the side somehow. She killed all these Miss Nobles, right? She's still dead? Damn, that's pretty fucking wild. Alright, so yeah, it's over here. I don't remember exactly how to get over here. Okay, I, th I think I got it. I think I've deduced enough to get it. So, you go over here. Bam. Then you go. There we go, I got it. I grabbed it. So, now we're on top of this Japanese style building. I don't believe you can get over there, but I've, I, I don't think I've ever tried either. So there's a swing, there's a rope point that you can grab, I do believe. But, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and just run it. So I'm pissed. Fuck. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start the episode, I'm going to stop the episode kind of short. And, thank you for watching. If you did, like, uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do all that good shit. And, next part will be a lot more exciting. Anyways, I hope you enjoy your evening, your morning, whatever you're having. Check me out in the next part. Anyways, peace.